total raise uh, investment of $145 million that we have raised from uh, Google and uh, our existing partner, uh, Mithril Capital. Uh, so very happy with uh, with that. And it's a, it's a big validation for what Glance has achieved in a very short period of its uh, existence in the last uh, you know, 18 to 19 months of, uh, of what we have, uh, you know, of what we have achieved in the form of completely changing the consumer experience of people, of consumers um, uh, of their mobile phones uh, across India and across Southeast Asia. Um, and as you know, what Glance does, it, it changes the, uh, converts the lock screen into an AI-led content platform. And it's a, a very simple product, but it is a very engaging product, which has, uh, which today has uh, over 115 million daily active users who are spending more than 25 minutes uh, on the platform. So we're very excited with, with this uh, with this new development and also very kicked about the fact that we've been able to build a very engaging consumer platform uh, you know, from India and we're taking it globally. Right, so for users wondering what Glance does, essentially when you leave your phone in lock screen mode, uh, most Android phones that Glance works with, whatever content you know comes up here is most probably powered by Glance. So as Naveen said, such a simple but powerful innovation because you end up looking at your lock screen multiple times a day. But uh, Naveen, you know, I read a quote of yours a couple of months ago where you said you believe your business to consumer, your B2C business will be valued at over a billion dollars. So does this current round of funding then make Glance a unicorn, which will be significant because, you know, Inmobi is India's first unicorn. The fact that Glance also is now a unicorn coming from the same stable would be a pretty significant achievement. So does this new round of funding make Glance a unicorn? You know, it's very hard to comment on these things. And so I would refrain from answering that question. But what I would say is that this is, you know, the first time in movie became a unicorn, it was a great moment for us. And this is, uh, this investment from Google and from Mithril uh, is a very, very, very substantial moment for us. And uh, and we feel very kicked about that. But, you know, from a valuation point of view, you know, it's hard to interview anything. But uh, we're very happy with the fact that we're getting associated with you know, uh, getting further validation of, uh, of Mithril coming in into this round and of Google investing, it gives a great validation for the innovation that we have, uh, that we have made. So we're very kicked about that. Right. In fact, very powerful investors now on, uh, you know, Glance's cap table. Mithril, of course, which is a fund co-founded by the by Peter Thiel. And now you have Google coming on board. Naveen, take us through how this happened. Because when I look at the InMobi business, which is, you know, the mobile advertising business, you technically compete with the likes of Google and Facebook. Yet Google now has come on board as an investor in an other business you own, you know, which is a consumer platform, Glance. So how did this work out? You know, companies like Google are in multiple businesses. They are such a powerful, uh, you know, technological companies globally present there, whether it's in the search or the advertising or, you know, video or cloud, they are in, in many, many businesses. And so, uh, you know, they, they for, for literally every technolo technology company out there, they will be...